Acts of Pilate. The Report of Pilate to the Emperor Claudius. Pontius Pilate unto Claudius, greeting. There befell of late a matter which I myself brought to light, or, made trial of, for the Jews through envy have punished themselves and their posterity with fearful judgments of their own fault. For whereas their fathers had promises, ow, had announced unto them, that their God would send them out of heaven his Holy One who should of right be called their King, and did promise that he would send him upon earth by a virgin. He then, or this God of the Hebrews, then, came when I was governor of Judea, and they beheld him enlightening the blind, cleansing lepers, healing the palsied, driving devils out of men, raising the dead, rebuking the winds, walking upon the waves of the sea dry shod, and doing many other wonders, and all the people of the Jews calling him the Son of God. The chief priests therefore, moved with envy against him, took him and delivered him unto me and brought against him one false accusation after another, saying that he was a sorcerer and did things contrary to law. But I, believing that these things were so, having scourged him, delivered him unto their will, and they crucified him, and when he was buried they set guards upon him. But while my soldiers watched him he rose again on the third day. Yet so much was the malice of the Jews kindled that they gave money to the soldiers, saying, Say ye that his disciples stole away his body. But they, though they took the money, were not able to keep silence concerning that which had come to pass, for they also have testified that they saw him arisen and that they received money from the Jews. And these things have I reported, unto thy mightiness, for this cause, lest some other should lie unto thee, lat. Lest any lie otherwise, and thou shouldest deem right to believe the false tales of the Jews.